All right, guys, how you doing? I tell you straight the name of this intrusive app. It's called Private Compute Services. Sounds boring. Sounds like a tool your phone needs to function well. And that is exactly what they want you to think. I tell you really short what this app does. It, for example, it uh, autofills forms. It um, suggests answers in messaging apps like WhatsApp or whatever you are using. If you are watching a video in a language you don't understand, it will automatically add subtitles for you. Well, it sounds all so convenient, doesn't it? But in reality, this is the most intrusive tools I've ever seen in my life on an Android phone. I tell you why. This app is tracking your every behavior. It knows exactly where you're going. It knows how fast you're going. If you're in a car, if you're walking, in a plane. It has a gyroscope inside. This means it knows exactly in what position your phone's if. If it's shaking, if it's going like this. Then it's constantly listening for sounds. It's called music playing. And what that does is, it's just picking up that music from the neighbors, from that house, from the neighbors, from my little brother in the in the, another room, dogs barking, cars passing by. It's all going to be recorded behind your name. Nobody knows what for. <laughs> it is also following our eyes. It's hard to believe it's really true. It's, it, it knows if you're looking at your phone, and it also knows more or less where on your phone you are looking. Also going to be stored. Yep. Well, that is intrusive surveillance, isn't it? Listen, guys, I'm not sending nudes over the internet. I'm not threatening nobody. I'm not blackmailing nobody. I'm not trying to scam or seduce people over the internet. And I guess you aren't either, are you? <laughs> so why are we being watched? Last step in this video is I'm going to show you how to disable this app. It cannot be removed unless you use ADB, but that's only for professionals. Click on settings. Scroll down to apps and click on it. And here we are on alphabetical order. Go to the P and there you find private compute services. Click on it. Then click on permissions and make sure it says no permissions allowed. It's cool on my phone. Go to mobile data, click on it and switch off allow background data usage. The one below it goes with it automatically. Go back, click on battery and put it on restricted. All right, that's it. Now we disable the app that's at the bottom. Click on it and confirm with disable app and we're done. Listen guys, very important for me, support this channel. My videos are helpful, I just know that. Like and subscribe. See you in my next video.